Hi, in this video, I'm going to answer the question of whether you can use the Makita LXT DUB 182 blower to dry your car after a car wash. I've had many people ask me this question, so here I'm going to answer the question practically. Right, so the question is, can you use this Makita LXT to dry your car after you've had a car wash? It is a cool day, uh, the car is actually cool. So I'm going to now use the blower and blow out the water. So to answer the question uh, whether you can use it to dry your car, uh, yes, you can. It, it does work. Well, should you? Well, you'll have to make that decision. Should I? Absolutely not. It's totally impractical. A lot of uh, time, as you can see, using a towel would be much quicker and easier. Also, uh, what you can see is the water droplets almost spatter. So they move to other parts of the car. So you've got to go over and over and over. Um, if you leave the car to dry for about 20 minutes and it's only got light droplets, yes. But if it's completely wet and it's almost like a stream of water, then no. You see here in the window, you can see it gives a nice finish. But then you can see what happens is um, the little droplets spatter. What is nice is that if you do leave some of those little droplets it doesn't leave a dusty residue now, normally when you wash a car sometimes it's a bit dusty if it just was like almost like rained and then left so what's nice about the blower is it actually removes the dust at the same time so if you didn't dry it properly it's still fine if you leave it to dry uh, for another like say five minutes just air dry so overall it's a lot of arm work and so is a towel so i would rather do the towel because it's quicker and also, you'll go through at least one battery to dry your entire car if you have to do it properly. The, why the, this is a problem is you have to get very close to the car. And when you get very close to the car, you have to wave the uh, blower quite vigorously up and down. But if, you, if the blower is maybe stronger and plugged into the electricity, you could stand maybe half a meter away and dry large portions of the car at once. But because this is something that uh, kind of lifts more leaves and things like that, and probably not made for drying cars, um, you've got to be quite close, unless the car is just partially wet. But as you saw, we wet the car completely because it was after a car wash. So overall, I would not recommend doing this. Uh, this seems to be a little bit impractical and tiresome. If you're just drying a spill on the floor, yeah, the blower works. But remember that the surface area of an entire car is actually quite large. So I wouldn't readily use this to dry a car, just use a towel. Thanks for watching. Cheers.